Hello everyone. I am Dr. Shivdas Madhavan, Associate Professor of English, Walaita Soda University, Ethiopia. I am going to talk about research proposal. Research proposal is a statement of intent prepared by the research scholar or it is the plan of research submitted for the permission of the research committee or the group of professors who are authorized to accept the research proposal and there are no rules there are no rules to guide the research writer or the research scholar but there are certain practices people follow a researcher has to follow that practice and it depends on the university every university will have its own guidelines so a researcher has to follow the guidelines of the university or the institution and PhD research will be slightly different from the master's research. Master's research they do for the master's course that is for MA or MSc. It will be only for one semester or one year. But in the case of PhD research it will be three years or four years or even more than that. So the time period will be different for uh, PhD research and uh, master's research and master's research will be most of the time based on the past information or past knowledge but PhD research is always contributing something new to the existing body of knowledge so that way PhD research looks forward but master's research is collecting and collating the information which is already available in the existing body of knowledge so that difference you can see in uh, master's research and uh, phd research another thing is the term used to refer to these researches in america they say dissertation for the phd research and thesis for the master's research but in the case of uh, british english they say thesis for the PhD research and dissertation for the master's research. So it's only a matter of uh, terms used by different people in the same language English. And sometimes people use it interchangeably. So it's up to you and you can use uh, any term that you like. And when you come to the research writing, the, the proposal writing, the the important message or the advice given to the researchers is that take care of the four P's. Four P's. First P is person. Second P, preparedness. Third P, project. And fourth P, place. The, the first P is person. That is the researcher. You, you yourself. How are you? And what type of person are you? Uh, what is your background? What is your educational background? Uh, what is your quality to do the research? How qualified you are? That is first person. And second, preparedness. How prepared you are? What have you done to do the research? Your preparedness. And third P is the project. That is the topic itself. How interesting the topic is or uh, how nice the topic is for the research. And the last one is place. Place is the university or the place where you are working. So if the university is very famous, it will be good to do the research there. It will have good traditions and it will have uh, better experience and it will be easy for you to come to the standard. If the university has the standard, the students will also have the, the corresponding standard. So these four P's. P for person, P for preparedness, P for project and P for place. So if you take care of these, your research paper will be good or your proposal will be good. And there are some other things that you have to take care of in writing the research proposal. And that I will uh, talk about in the next video and this is enough for today. Thank you.